Yo, what's good, my YouTube people? What's good, what's good, what's good? It's your boy Orlando, man, back with a new video. Uh, before I get started, man, hit, just hit that like button, that subscribe button, man. And uh, we'll jump right into it. Man, I'm going to need to shoot today. Uh, mainly because I'm, you see how I look, man. I'm just, I'm in chill mode, man. I'm in relaxed mode. Uh, but, you know, I just felt that, that this might be a good time to go ahead on and just make a little video, man. And uh, on this video, man, I'm going I'm to deal with, um, with poverty thinking versus wealthy thinking. Poverty thinking versus wealthy thinking. Uh, when you have a po poverty thinking mind, it won't allow you to see wealth. It won't allow you to be able to see this. It's nothing you'll be able to see like this. You can't see this. The reason being is because it's in your spirit and it has been sent down through many generations. And no one before you broke the poverty thinking. So, can you actually really go after a mansion like this with poverty thinking? Can you, can you actually want, you can want it, but can you actually do what it take to get it? Will you have the determination to go after something like this with a poverty mind? Because poverty affects everyone around you. And let me tell you how that works. When you have a poverty mentality, it leaps it leaps so that's why they always say create the circle of people that thinks that think on a higher level that you're trying to get to. if you hang around with guess what you're going to one day be with it because you're going to do the necessary things it take to be with it poverty thinking people put everything of less value before things that actually have value. Like, poverty thinking people would do the necessary things to create more poverty for themselves. Wealthy thinking people do the opposite. You can't want this if you never can grab it. If you can never catch hold to this, how can you be determined to have it? I'm so, just coming to you guys, man, just saying how wealth is, wealth is, wealth work like po poverty just in reverse. Wealth actually generates more wealth, but it put everybody in a positive state of mind. Unlike poverty. Poverty keep everybody sad, you know, depressed, miserable. And it works. It, it, poverty, man, let me tell you. Poverty even a f Hey, yo, what's good? What's good, my YouTube people? Hey, I just want to pick back up where I left off, man, where I was talking about poverty thinking versus wealthy thinking. And, um, you know, before I, before my phone uh, cut out on me, man, I, was, I think I was talking about how poverty even affects your health. And how does it do that? It, it affects your health because... You won't do the necessary things to, re to, to stay healthy because you will always put an excuse before your health. It's all, it's like, you got to understand everybody can make an excuse. And poverty is not just, you know, how much money you don't have. It's, 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 it's your thinking. You can, you can be wealthy. You can become wealthy and have a poverty mentality. Yeah, I know that don't sound right, but I'm finna break it down to you. How many athletes you seen came from nothing and got rich? They had the wealth, they had the cars, they had the, 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 the houses, they had everything. Only to lose everything in 
go right back to poverty. We, we, we see that happen every day. Every day. And the reason being for that is because they obtained the wealth, but they still had the poverty, the poverty thinking. They still had the poverty spirit, which wouldn't allow them to create more wealth. So they spent their money on things of less value because of the poverty, the poverty thinking. Wealthy thinking people generates more wealth. That's how it works. And they also, you know, a lot of people like, well, you know, they got the necessary, they got the money to to buy the proper fruit, food and all that. And you might be right. But at the same time, it's still a mentality thing, it's still a mental thing, because a lot of them, they don't have to buy the the proper things to, to be healthy. A lot of them just know that that's part of the wealthy thinking. Your health. I, I remember I used to try to get a lot of guys to, to work out with me and man. And a lot of them used to say this was one of the main excuses. They were like, man, I don't have time. You know, I have to pay these bills or whatever. And I used to always have a comeback with, man, I never seen a dead man pay. One. <laughs> you know, just telling them your, your health. That's that's real huge, man. But I'm not going to be before you guys long, man. Smash that subscribe button, that like button. Hit that notification bell. And I'm going to have more videos coming like this, man. Some even deeper. So stay tuned.